Hello again, I am Cressup. Welcome to the fourth and possibly final segment of this Colossal Cave Let's Play. Hope you've been enjoying the previous ones. If you haven't caught them and want to, um, you should go check them out. I've got three already that I've put up uh, which feature me sort of exploring the cave, getting into it. The last one was a bit of a longer one, but we did quite a lot. Um, we found a giant. Uh, there was a troll. There was a bear. We're now in this green place that we're going to explore as well. I don't know what to, whether this will be anything, whether there'll be anything here, but we'll see. Um, so, yeah, do check out those previous ones that I made um, and, in general, the channel. Right, give me one second. Right. Uh, yeah, I don't know where, where we are now, but let's just um, let's see what we've got. Okay. So, yeah, we, we have to drop all our equipment on this side to pick things up here. And I don't know what this place is. I can't see anything now because I don't have the lamp. It is now pitch dark. If you proceed, you will most likely fall into a pit. Okay. Well, that's no good, is it? Oh. You hear the call of a plover. A plover? Some kind of bird. You're in the plover room. What? Who or what is a plover? Excised emerald. Excised emerald. Nothing. There's nothing to do with it here. Can I use it to light the room? Or I don't know. You are in a small chamber lit by an eerie green light. An extremely narrow tunnel exits to the west. A dark corridor leads northeast. Yes. So I've dropped all that and then there's a dark... You're, you're in a dark room. Mm. Okay. I don't want to keep going back to the troll. Uh, this is a, a strange little area. So, just thinking where else we could go. We've not been that way. This is all kind of done. We've done all of this. Little bit. Troll. Done the maze alike. We should... Maybe bring some of the treasure back. We don't have that key for the bear, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, I don't know if there's much else I can do in this room without some kind of light source. You're in the plover room. Of course. We all know what a plover is. Oh, what a plover. Oh, that, I mean, thank God I can get out of here with the emerald. <laughs> right. So yeah, that's that's that. I guess let's let's just save. Now those rots keep dropping. Is that because a dwarf is going to jump on me? Or no. The Orient Room and then Southeast we have not been. Oh, 
Oh, have we? Swiss cheese room. To orient to bed quilt, south or east. Let's go south. Not a huge plan for this session. It's just kind of explore places we've already been and You've crawled around in some little holes oh, and wound up back this. in the main passage. That's that bit here. Just see if there's other places we haven't been to, really. Water, That's bottle of water. Dwarf's axe. Egg, I we dwarf's should. axe. Oh! So we can go back to there. What happens if I do that now? That's interesting. <gasps> oh! So that means I can get there with... You hear the call of a plover. That is useless right now. Yeah, so I could I could make my way into that room without getting rid of everything. Okay, so we do have a way of Right, exciting times. We've got a plan. Hmm, I don't think I've been up this way. The steps are extremely steep. Luckily there's a rope to hang on to. Thank gosh. Makes me feel a bit dizzy that. Oh, it's the other way. What is this? What? This rug. The dragon looks rather nasty. Let's not try to get by. All right, pal. A huge, green, fierce dragon bars the way. So Bottle pour, of water. Pour some water on it. The dragon doesn't seem to be interested in that. <laughs> Brass lantern. Do you look at Spelunker Spelunker today? today. There's no the dragon doesn't seem to be interested in that. Look at Spelunker today, mate. Attack a dragon. With your bare hands? Perhaps one reckless would try that. Oh! Congratulations. You just vanquished a dragon with your bare hands. Unbelievable, isn't it? I... What? Oh, I feel a bit bad. I just punched him in the noggin. You don't want to beat a defeated dragon. No. It's had a hard enough day as it is. I can't believe that actually worked. Yes, man. Oh, I feel a bit bad. Are you okay, mate? Whoops. I can't believe that worked. That's so funny. It's got a bit of humor Dwarf's this game. Dwarf's Persian rug. Got Persian rug. Yes, come on. We're living life. Look at this. Let's. Did I save? Right, we'll have to go back round now. But I think that's fine. Just bumped him on the noggin. Yes, man. The wide steps are blocked by a mass of boulders. Careful, don't burn yourself. So I can't head down. Just gave him a right old bump. You are above a tall east-west canyon. You see an immense passage to the west. Cooey. You're in a secret east-west canyon above a tight canyon below. Could I drop down here? Let's just see. Let's save. Will I die? Yes. Goodness. That was a mighty yes, fall. Yes, I will. Okay, but you know, we learn. We learn. Oh dear. Can I, maybe I'll hop onto that? You're looking down at a tall east-west canyon. Let's just see again. It's probably going to die again, but let's just see. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. 
That was a mighty fall. <laughs> okay, right. We've got the idea. Oh there. dear. We've explored a fair amount of this now. Okay, up we go. Better not have any dwarves appearing. Soon as she says that, <laughs> they will pop up. Right. Yes, I fell down here the first time as well. Oh, don't do it again. I almost did it again. At your feet is a small pit breathing traces of mist. I don't care. Right, we've got the bird. This. I wonder if there's any more little points of discovery, any more little transportation, teleportation points. Looks like possibly no, but okay. Now we can at least do this. Zizzy. Uh, Zizzy. Zizzy. Mm. You feel a strange pulling sensation. I'm doing quite well. I mean, I wish I hadn't died. You're back that in the time. well house. Or broken the vase. Those are my regrets. Bra Jeweled trident. Great, I've got some points there. Persian rug. Not bad, not bad. Spit egg-sized emerald. Yes, man. Look at all these treasures. So. Now let's see if this works. You hear the call of a plover. That won't work here. Oh, interesting. So where will it work? Have I got to go to the room? Oh, that's annoying if that's the case. Although it's good to get rid of the treasure. Oh, there's the old rug. I bet that vase just had to go somewhere like there, which is really quite irritating if that's the case. So I just go up the way I started. I didn't actually look backwards to see if there's anything. I don't think there is. No, it's all blocked. That's it. I'm never leaving. Oh, let's just have a little explore around. Just in case we're missing anything. I don't think so. Okay, what was I going to... Spelunker today. Can I? I mean, I Spelunker really. Spelunker today. I don't know what to do with Spelunker today. Spelunker today. Nothing happens. It's kind of taking up room. Um. <sighs> hmm. So what, when do I? thought I'd just use it in here. You hear the call of a plover. There's no use for that here. <laughs> okay. Where is there use for it? I mean, is it in the little... You hear the call of a plover. There's nothing to do with it here. Hmm. Is it in the room where the bird was? Possibly. Uh, there's an owl there. Where was the owl again? Hmm. A large owl seems to be watching you. Hiya. You hear the call of a plover. There's no use for that here. Okay. Mm. 
I'll try it in the room where the bird was first, where I caught it in the cage, and then I'll try it in the room before where that plo the before the plover room. Don't think you can't go through that way, can you? No. <clears throat> Yeah, because look, you see, it saw it, there's a little picture of a bird singing on the map. Oh. Bra you hear the call of a plover. That is useless right now. That's a shame, I thought, maybe. Bird chamber, you would think! Hmm, in which case it's a bit annoying, because I don't want to... Where do I want to get to? I want to get to... Oh, gosh. Do, 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 do. Excuse me while I just look at this. I want to get to the Orient, really. Oh, gosh. Got nine treasure, and we would have had more were it not for that bloody troll. Um, okay. Want to get to the Orient. So quickest is probably to go to the tro the giant's room. Okay. Hope you're all paying attention. Oh, right back again. Zizzy, Zizzy, you feel a strange pulling sensation. You're back in the well house. Right. Okay, let's see if this works. Hopefully it does. Fee, fi, fo, fee, fi, fo, fu. I hope this doesn't summon a giant. The golden eggs have vanished. Oh? That's fun. Fee fi fo fu. Fee fi fo fu. There's nothing to do with it here. Interesting. So I can keep giving the troll golden eggs. Right, so fee fi fo fu does not let me transport. Oh, God. Okay. Well, what's the closest then? So I could just steal those again. Excellent. Um, I want to get to the Orient. To Orient. Swiss cheese room. And so I can only do... Oh, Plu, then, I guess. Just do Plu. 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 You feel a strange pulling sensation. And I'll try and pick up those eggs as well. You're back in the Y2 room. Right. Uh, 
This is a long way to go to get to this Orient. Swiss cheese room. Two pit is where I want to go. Yo! It's the new rapper, Two Pit! I think this was the you way. You need to be a little closer to climb that. Oh. Alright then. It feels like we've not really done a lot in this episode. It's just been going back and forth. I suppose we did. We did um, get some treasure. You need to be a little closer to climb that. Right, and then it was this away. And then it was this away. Wait, was the Orient it was actually in this room, and that was northwest. The Orient. The Orient Express. Must be here. And then we went... Which Oh. How did we get to the dark room? So we went north... God, I'm going to save, actually. I'm just thinking <laughs> something's going to happen here. That's right. We went round here. Oh, there's a lot. That's what am I doing? Right, okay. All the way. Now, let's just see. It's too tight. You best drop something. You hear the call of a plover. Nothing happens. Mm, okay. I don't know what that's about then. Let's just see if I use it when in there. Let's just see. I'll drop dwarf's axe. I'll drop these things. Bot brass land bottle of water. Spelunker. It's nice that the, the the bottle doesn't break, but anyway. Just see if I use plover that whilst in there. In front of this bird, maybe. You hear the call of a plover. Mm. You feel a strange pulling sensation. Will this take me back to the treasure room? It's dark here. Oh! Where are you? It's too dark. You can't see a thing. Oh, God. My oh, goodness. <laughs> that was a mighty fall. I didn't even... I barely moved. Seasoned adventurer. So that's interesting then, but how do I... I need to... Somehow have light with me, but it won't let me take it. It let me take the emerald, though. Hmm. Let's just see. Oh, no. I'm going to go back and take the emerald and just see if that does anything. In fact, can I load a previous... when that was hmm, no I can't remember 
Two pit southeast. It's two pit. Let's go. Let's go. Lots of back and forth in this episode, I'm afraid. There is a threatening dwarf. Mm, okay. A sharp knife is thrown. Don't let it hit me, please. It missed. Yeah. Dwarf's axe. You have vanquished a little dwarf. Great. Swiss cheese room. We want to go to two pits. So up we go here. Or is it this way? Oh! I haven't been here before. How did I miss this? A small velvet pillow lies on the floor. There's no use for that here. You're in a soft room. The walls are covered with heavy curtains, the floor with a thick shag carpet. Moss covers the ceiling. What in the name of Psytrance is this? These kaleidoscopic mushrooms are trippy to say the least. <laughs> Why did he go a bit Australian then? You must not touch them. They are sensitive and may shrink away. There's nothing to do with it here. You must not touch them. They are sensitive and may shrink away. Come on, let me have one. Dwarf, dwarf's axe. Let me have a bit of mushy. That won't work here. There's nothing to do with it here. Bottle of water. Velvet pillow. Velvet pillow. Hmm. Velvet pillow. Where on earth could I use a velvet pillow? You hear the call of a plover. That won't work here. Okay. Oh, the evil eyes. How the hell did I miss this room? Um, let's go to the south. I don't know if we've, if we've been there either. I don't know how I missed this place. We all know what's going to happen here. You've crawled around yep. in some little holes and wound up back in the main passage. Yep. Yep. So that's west, back to where we actually do want to go. But I'm just trying to see. It says south as if that's a way to go. seem like you can though you've crawled around in some okay. little holes and wound up Not back in the main be bothered with that uh da, 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 da. west in passage it's funny i've never seen that room though <laughs> now I could just pick up the golden eggs as well, seeing as I'm going back. Because I'm assuming they'll have disappeared and gone back to where they were. Don't run into a dwarf. Yeah. There you go. That's quite Thank fun you. then. That's funny that I gave that to the troll. <laughs> Handy to know though. Um So I've got a little cushion. 
don't know if that counts as treasure. I mean, it's velvet, I suppose, but it's not exactly treasure. It's just a cushion. Don't want to go to the giant. Well, that's it. I was going to see if the emerald works as a light source. Okay, so west. And then I'll just have to look where else to go because I don't know... Um Down here, bed quilt. Confusing around here. Southwest. Have I even been southwest? So many places to explore. So that's just the way I've come from. And I've never helped that bear. They're still going round in circles. You need to be a little closer to climb that. Don't know which is the quickest way back here, but let's just see. Is that dragon still going to be knocked out? Yeah. Oh, God. Sorry. A huge defeated dragon is lying off to one side. How'd you get down here as well? So what area is this? Down only. Oh, you can go down there. Okay. Hmm. Is it worth doing that? Just having a little explore, why not? So, okay, let's just save, actually. <laughs> because there was a little... I can't assume I can't go, okay. The canyon here becomes too tight to go further south. Mm -hmm. There he is. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, off he goes. He can't stand it. Honestly, these little dwarves, they're just not, they're just not all there, are they? Right, he's just gonna, right, okay. I feel a bit bad. What was he even working on here? So that's up where I was, great, okay. Any little treasures or anything? Oh, you must have run down here. And that takes me here again. So there was the south, right? I see. And that's why maybe I couldn't go that way? I don't know. Uh... Right, anyway, well, that's good to know. It didn't really help us, but, you know. Little mystery cleared up. Through here. West. There you go. Sorry, mate. Maybe he's not there anymore, is he? Don't think there was anything else down there. I missed, but good to know anyway that I can get down that way. 
Starting to learn this area pretty well. Yes, and then we're back here. Okay. No dwarves, please. Still haven't gotten across the bridge, though. Do I have to maybe do the little bird sign? There must be a way to cross this fissure. East Bank Fissure, West Bank Fissure. Hmm. I couldn't, couldn't find any way of... Sorry, I was just studying there. Maybe if I... I mean, I've got to the other side, so it's not like it really matters, but... Maybe if I sing like a little bird. <laughs> you hear the call of a plover. That is useless, right? Okay. Velvet pillow. Lovely little velvet pillow. We go once more with feeling. I'm annoyed the bird thing doesn't work here, but uh, hey ho. Right, come on, Sissy, where are you? Zizzy, Zizzy, you feel a strange pulling sensation. You're back in the well house. Okay. Is this Velvet treasure? Pillow. There is a velvet pillow here. I wonder if that's where I had to put the vase. <laughs> hmm. Just leave the door wide open as well. Uh, okay. Take the emerald. Just to see. I don't really know Egg, if it'll egg work. Egg-sized emerald. Egg-sized emerald. I don't know. Okay, I've got all the way back. Eggs. You hear the call of a plover. Nope. Nothing happens. Okay, I just thought, I don't know why I keep thinking that will work. Clue. You feel a strange pulling sensation. You're back in the Y2 room. Egg-sized emerald. Hello. Um. Oh yeah, and there was this guy, wasn't there? There was someone like waving. Hello. It's me. There's nothing to do with it here. It's me. The shadowy figure seems to be trying to attract your attention. <laughs> don't know if it's spo is it supposed to be moving when I move? I think it's just I don't know. Who knows in this crazy game? It's just I'm going to try this bird thing everywhere just as Say. You hear the call of a plover. Ah. You feel a strange pulling sensation. So, okay. You're in the plover room. Oh! 
Yes! And I've got the light. Yes, man. Congratulations on bringing light into the dark room. It says, congratulations on bringing light into the dark room. I mean... Yeah, thank you. There is a platinum pyramid here. That's all we needed, folks. Nice. Anything else in here? Don't think so. Now, how are we gonna... Let's just save. Nice one. Uh... Platinum Pyramid. You hear the call of a plover. What's going to happen now? You feel a strange pulling sensation. Where am I going to go now? You're back in the Y2 room. Right. Interesting. Interesting. So that that's like a kind of transportation with the emerald, right? And now I can just say blue. 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 Very interesting. You feel a strange pulling sensation. We're doing pretty well here. I don't know if that pyramid is supposed to be used for anything else. You're back in the well house. Platinum Pyramid. Right. Um, what else have I not explored now? Because I've got a fair amount of treasure. Not everything, but... This is a there's a lot going on here. That goes to bed quilt, which we have explored. This, this, this secret canyon, yeah. Misty pit, gold chamber. Haven't gotten across this, but then do we need to? Long call. This might be a bit to explore. What else is there? Done pretty well. I feel like we've explored a fair bit. Oh yeah, I dropped that there, didn't I? That goes to the troll. Dead end. Secret Canyon. Yeah, and I dropped down here, didn't I? And that goes up to there. Crude passage. Dirty broken passage. Hmm. I feel like we've explored quite a lot of this area now. dark room that's yeah okay chamber boulders lovely like barren room not going in that maze unless I have to <laughs> that all feels like we've explored all of this as well hmm I'm not quite sure what else there is to, to... I mean, there must be some little bits, but... Maybe this area, just... Yeah, that's the only thing I can sort of see. Clue. Clue. You feel a strange pulling sensation. 
My hope was to get to 200 points. You're so. back in the Y2 room. We'll see in the next 10 minutes or so. We can manage that, but no worries if not. Okay, so... Let's go south. We're in the Hall of the Mountain King, so we want to go west. Did we ever go up here? Oh yeah, this was like kind of a bit of a weird, it was like, oh, I, I can't do anything with any of this. Okay. There's definitely some bits I haven't solved yet. But I feel we've made a fair bit of progress. Right, so if I go south, what is up here? Right, the miners tunnels, okay. Oh! <laughs> what? Everything looks the same, where am I? May's different. Um. Oh my gosh, this is nuts! I do like it keeps dropping these little surprises on you. There's a lot going on. I'm just trying to get the connecting bits and then I'll, I'll try and go down, I guess. Or up? I don't know. Oh, look at this. How did I even get to here? Just when you think you've discovered everything. <laughs> you need to be a little closer to climb that. As l at least the hints aren't coming up. <laughs> this is bonkers, quite frankly. You're in a maze of twisty little passages, all different. Well, they're not all different. They look exactly the same. I think you're lying, narrator. This, you know, there's a little bit of sort of weirdness in this game that I, I quite like. A little bit of like what's actually a bit like with inscription where. There's layers underneath where you're a bit like, what's happening here? I really don't know. What I'm trying to do is just make more of them appear on the thing. But this is a bonkers. You need to be a little closer to climb that. I don't know if there's going to be something I find in one of these rooms, or if this is just just loads of rooms, basically. <laughs> Doesn't even show me which one I'm in. Have I found them all? Right, so I've got there's nearly all of them. Right, let's just do this methodically. Northeast, and then which one's northeast? So this next one, east, and then southeast, and then 
then south, and then southwest, and then west, and then northwest. This one is north. Well, I haven't got that one in the bottom. Huh, weird. Well, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down the ladder a couple of times and just see if anything changes. And if not, I'll start going up, I guess. the hell did I get <laughs> I don't even know how this is I I really was not expecting this one ladder goes up another goes down right I'll go one you more need to down. be a little closer to climb that but I don't think uh, it doesn't seem to be doing anything when I do that There's like a ladder. Do you need help getting out of oh. the maze? If you are, I am prepared to give you no, a hint. I'm good. But it will cost you four points. Nope. If you would like the hint, Don't let that touch start the again. before you. But hurry before the glow disappears. I'm guessing you just gotta go up. I don't know what hint it's gonna give me apart from just Because I, I went down about three times. Just going to keep going up. Oh, there's ladders everywhere. Oh, God. Well, we're really getting a thorough mapping of this area. <laughs> I don't really want to ask for hints, but I, I mean, don't know. At least in that other thing, there were different places. There were different rooms, but this is all just the same room. You need to be a little closer to I mean, climb I that. I mean, I could use the... I don't think I can even use the chance, can I? Should have left that emerald where it was, because then I can just get out whenever. I think you've got to be at that Y2 room. Oh, I don't want to use hints. But hmm, I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, boy. Yeah, how, how did this... How did I get into this? This mess? So I just keep trying to go specific way. Keep trying to go north, maybe. Just see how that operates. Now, does that update? Yeah, see, I'm in this room then, clearly. Uh, but what does that even mean? What does it mean? Oh, 
But then, okay, so if I go this way, what does it mean? Well, this is a fun bit of the stream. <laughs> oh dear. Last time I was in this, in Wits End, I just kept climbing up and then I eventually got out. But something tells me that's not going to be the case here. Yeah, all these ladders keep popping up, which I don't quite get what that means. Um... Problem is, I don't know where I am. Because if I could, if I could tell at least where I was, then I, I suppose I can work it out by what things update. But um, seems quite arduous. And it's kind of hard to work out. Well, so like if I went up the ladder here, where would I then be? Oh, God. I mean, we could just try brute forcing it, but. I think all the ladders are, are like this, aren't they? There's one ladder there, one ladder there. So it just depends where on earth I am right now. Right, so let's just. Let's go down a ladder and see what updates. One, two, okay, we've only got a down ladder there and a down ladder there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I might have to end this. <laughs> so what updated down ladder wires? This one. So if I went north east, let's just see. This could be madness, everybody. But I think I am now in here, possibly. And then if we went down. You need to be a little closer to climb that. Right? No. Oh. Am I here now? Let's try going east. Let's try going to the corner. I think I'm here, but I don't really know. But let's work by that logic, maybe. Well, let's go down one more. You need to be a little closer oh, to climb sorry that. Sorry about that. Sorry. I'll give this like a couple more goes and then I'll... I'll stop. Mmm... I mean, I don't know what I do otherwise. I suppose I wait for the hint to come up, but. I 
because I don't really, yeah, this might have to take another episode. <laughs> Damn it, and we were so close to doing quite well. Right, I'll get a couple more goes of this and then we'll leave it here. Because I um, I'm gonna have to maybe look this up. I don't I don't quite know. I don't really want to use the hint. You need to be a little closer to climb say? that. Just follow your compass or something. Two, three, so yeah, I'm not sure. Don't know if there's some like visual clue or something I'm supposed to be looking at, because like there's a cable there. Am I supposed to just follow where that is? Maybe I don't know. Cable shows this way, maybe. Do you need help getting out of the maze? Well, if you are, I am prepared to give you a hint, but it will cost you four points. If you would like the hint, touch the glow before you. But I'm going to save and then see what the hint is. I think that's the way to do it. Let's just see. You can make the passages look less alike by dropping things. Interesting. Interesting. What? Dwarf Spelunker today. Dropping things all in a in a row or Dwarf's act. So I've just gotta drop everything? Bottle of water. Haven't got really much to drop. Brass lantern. I forgot to drop certain things in certain rooms. Is that what it means? Or does it... Right, I think... Uh, okay, I've got what it means. It, all they mean is drop things so you know which room you're in. I see. Okay. I'm guessing. Because then you could be like, right, this is this room. I see. Okay. And you can work your way out. It is now pitch dark. If you proceed, you will most likely fall into a pit. Oh, because I left my bloody lantern, right? I should have... Oh, for God's sakes. Bottle. Bottle of Spelunker today. We we'll drop Spelunker. And then, yes, right, okay, so you can then be like, right, that's there. Right, so Spelunker was here? Well, where was it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Bottle have of water. Things. Right, okay. Oh my goodness. Right, and I think... Right, bottle of water. Right, so let's just go... There's my water, okay. Oh! Kenna Cell. 
There is a massive vending machine here. The instructions on it read, drop coins here to receive fresh batteries. Well, I don't have any coins. Coins are needed here. There's no use for that. Nothing happened. There's nothing to do with it here. There's nothing there but stinky trash. You're in a dead end. There is a massive vending machine here. The instructions on it read, drop coins here to receive fresh batteries. Intriguing. Right, you know what? I'm going to save and leave it there for now. But very interesting little part of this game. I guess we'll have to finish it in the next one. I was thinking we were going to do it in four, but um, five it is. Cheerio, everybody. Uh, I should say, uh, do feel free to check back the other ones if you haven't already. I'll, I'll put them in into a little Let's Play. And uh, if you like this, if you're enjoying this, um, do please give me a like and a subscribe. Trying to hit that 1,000 subscribers at some point soon. Um, and I don't just do Let's Plays. I do game developer interviews. Interviewed Ron Gilbert, Dave Grossman, Kevin Brighting, the Stanley Parable narrator, um, Sam Barlow, uh, who's made her story and immortality. Lots of cool people. So do check out the game developer interviews as well. All right. See you next time for, I think, the final part. We'll see.